Hey guys, what's good? Triple J Boxing here. Just watched Floyd Mayweather versus John Gotti the third, And I gotta say, I was just as disappointed as I thought I was gonna be. I mean, the most exciting part about it is when they were showing the banners for other fights coming up. Like when they were showing like Joshua Dubois. I was like, that got me a little excited seeing that banner show up uh, during the the rest between rounds but yeah other than that i mean it's an exhibition so like pretty much like i'm not a fan of exhibitions period so it doesn't matter who it is but i mean this one was pretty boring pretty bad i mean it looked like it was going to be all kind of staged acting like wwe at the start there when they switched refs it was kind of weird but then it kind of just went according to plan um, no, no funny business. Um, but I mean, both guys weren't, didn't look like they were really trying to throw hard shots, which it is an exhibition. I understand. Um, you're not going all out and they weren't at all. You could see Mayweather wasn't trying. He wasn't putting power in his shots. He looks soft. Um, cause he is older. He's obviously not training as hard. God, he looked like he wasn't throwing hard at all either. I mean, both guys love each other because the amount of money they're making. Like, you, you see Mayweather smiling during the fight. It wasn't because he was having fun in there and he was because of the fight, which may, maybe it was part of it. But, I mean, he was smiling because he's like, I can't believe I can make this kind of money doing this. And uh, at the end of the fight, showed a lot of respect, both guys. I mean, who wouldn't when you make that kind of... I don't know how much they got paid, but they got paid more than you should. Um, so why wouldn't you like each other and show respect, right? Um, but yeah, the highlights of the night, pretty much the best part of the fight was, like I said, seeing the upcoming fights, those banners showing up at the bottom of your screen, um, showing the respect, I guess, at the end of the fight. I always like seeing that, I guess, but I mean, I don't know. Um, Julio Cesar Chavez was there, had an interview there, talked to Mayweather a bit, so I guess that'd be a highlight in the night, but. <clears throat> the fight of the, the fight itself, I mean, obviously Mayweather's not going to be the same at 47. He looks soft, and and if you looked at Manny Pacquiao's exhibition against uh, Ampo in ja, in Japan last month, I mean, he didn't look great either, and he Pacquiao looks soft as well in the body. But I mean, that was actually more entertaining and more exciting. They actually were throwing decently hard shots. In that fight, whereas this fight, it didn't look like they were trying at all. It looked like they were just trying to collect the paycheck and go. Um, but what do you expect? It's an exhibition, guys. I mean, don't watch it if you don't like it, right? Um, but yeah, guys. Um, I really don't like exhibitions. I only want to see Floyd Mayweather come back and actually have a real fight. And I don't, and I, I don't expect him to come back and fight like Terrence Crawford or... Or whatever. I, I just mean like if you're going to continue to fight. I feel like you should fight guys like around your own age. But a real fight. Like I want to see him. Like if he fought Pacquiao again. That would be good. If he fought uh, um, someone around his age. Right? Like even uh, like uh, Miguel Cotto again. Or uh, Juan Manuel Marquez. Like if the, these guys were willing to fight him. I know Pacquiao would be. But if these other guys that are around his age range. Um, that he previously fought or maybe he didn't even fight. Um, I wouldn't mind seeing that in real fight. But I, it just these exhibitions, you know, it's just not as entertaining. And uh, I mean, like, the only way you can win is by knockout. But it looks like both guys have a silent agreement. Like, we're, like they tell each other, like, no, well, we're not going to go too hard. You know, let's just collect this this paycheck and go home. And that's the way this fight kind of went. But, I mean, uh, let me know what you guys thought about it. I mean, the crowd was booing. They didn't really like it at the end of the fight. Um, but, like I said, what do you expect, guys? It's an exhibition, and it's a Mayweather exhibition on top of that. He's not known to be a brawler or an exciting guy. Like, I know he's got skills. Some people some people like his style of boxing. But, I mean, like, for the casual fan, for the for the fan who likes more aggressive fighters more like action-packed fighters Mayweather wouldn't be your guy even if it was a real fight right now on top of that it's an exhibition so you it's like you shouldn't complain too much 
um, knowing that, you know what I mean? Um, but I'm just pointing out, like, the points here, guys. And uh, like I said, if you don't like it, don't watch it. But uh, I thought I'd just tune in. I had nothing else to really do. So I just watched it. Um, maybe got some WWE stuff. That's why that was... That was in the back of my head. Maybe we'll get some kind of drama there. But the fight itself, I didn't expect anyone to get knocked out, really, to be honest. And I definitely didn't expect Gotti to put a beating on Mayweather at all. Um, and that's how it played out. It played out how I thought it would play out. But yeah, on top of that, Mayweather definitely still has speed, though. He's got definitely still reflexes. But, I mean, he looks noticeably soft. And obviously, you can't really judge this fight at all because, like I said, it's not a real fight. He's definitely not in boxing shape. He's 47 years old. So obviously, you can critique stuff and say, yeah, his defense doesn't look as good anymore. He throws super wide shots in this fight. But, I mean, he does it because he can. And it doesn't really matter, right? Because there's no chance of him getting hurt. And it's not a real fight. So, But, yeah. Good for Gotti. He got that paycheck. And Mayweather gets another easy paycheck for him. And uh, yeah, this is Triple J Boxing, guys. Thanks for watching. And um, looking forward to the real fights coming up.